Yo, what's up, YouTube? Uh, my name is Jet Swarly, and welcome back to another video in my channel. In this new section, I did starting like Sunday, in which I make myself uh, some competitive uh, teams on Let's Go Overuse format in Pokemon Showdown. In my last video of this new section, I just I grabbed the uh, the most OP months in the format cu currently, but this time um I builded a team around Mega Venusaur. So before we go and search for for a battle, I want you to see my team builder, my team for Mega Venusaur in this a uh, video. First we have. Uh, Mega Venusaur with Lich Seed, Protect, and Sludge Bomb, Mega Drain. You can see it, but uh, you have uh, Mega Venusaur has a ball nature. So let's continue with Alana Mac, our psychic response with Crunch, Fire Blast for uh, Melt Metal, Disable, and Facade in case a starter EV. It uh, burns us with a sassy nature that uh, promotes the growth of a special defense and lowers the speed. We don't we don't need the speed on Makalala really. So ne next next uh, amount is Snorlax with facade. Again, if a starter EV wants to burn us, flamethrower also for melt metal. Seismic does for some damage on everything except on ghost types and John just to uh, make our opponent to switch out on setup months or some threats that could be problematic for my team. And it's not like with CC nature as well. So ne next is new with with bulk up, coal mine, roost, and facade. Bulk up, coal mine to boost, you know, the boost the defenses and and attacks, uh, both special and physical. Roost for recovery and facade. Again, in case if a starter EV wants to burn our mew. So this mew is hardly walled by melt metal. But that's why we have Lich Seed on Mega Venusaur, we have Fire Blast on Makalala, Flamethrower on Snorlax, and I guess that's it for Melt Metal, and with a careful nature here on Mew. Then we have Aerodactyl, our only Stealth Rocker taunt to taunt the, my opponent's Stealth Rockers, Earthquake to make some damage on Melt Metal and fire types and rock slide for flying types like Zapdos mainly with a jolly nature also earthquake hits uh, Gengar by the way then we have Zapdos with Roost, Substitute, Thunderbolt and Thunderweb with a calm nature Thunderweb to paralyze faster threats like Megalakazam Mega Gengar, Mega Aerodactyl, and regular Alakazam, Aerodactyl, and Gengar. Thunderbolt for some damage for Melt Metal. Substitute in case my opponent wants to switch to a Starter EV, so a Starter EV cannot uh, succeed us. And Roost to recover, well, health. Let me see if. If for some reason Zapdos gets the fog, no, it doesn't. So let's go validate. Yes, team is valid. So let's go and find some battles with this Mega Venusaur team. Yes. So we have our first opponent. We have Mew, a starter EV as always. We have Rhydon. Uh, I guess Mega Garados, Melt Metal, and Makalala. 
Well, I think he would like to start with Rhydon to set the stock rocks. So Mega Venusaur should be the best bet. If it starts with Mew, we can always change to Mac or our own Mew or our Aerodactyl. Venusaur or Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl is kind kinda useful for a Stone Edge, no Rock Slide that Gyarados. And before he eat Megas, I put for Mog and Mud Metal. So let's start with uh, Mega Venusaur. So it start with Gyarados. I think he thought that we would start with Aerodactyl. So let's uh, make about this Mega Venusaur and let's 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 see this Gyarados or Mega Drain. Now he won't change. He may change to Mel Metal if he wants to change or. Makalala, I don't want uh, some cheap damage on my Mega Venusaur, so I'm gonna go for for Mega Drain. Yes, really. Okay, now he he changed. There's the Mega Drain doing some some damage, not too much, but at this you no know, metal could do earthquake or. The double iron bash. So I think Zapdos is our best bet. He cannot. He cannot. He doesn't have the stealth box. So let's change to Zapdos. He double iron bash. It's okay. He can go to Rido. And we can. Uh, hard switch to our own aerodactyl to have the rocks so he doesn't uh, he change let's set our own rocks okay he did the same let's go for an earthquake it hits everything but the uh, Gyarados rock slide and that's the end of aerodactyl it's perfectly fine we can go for our Mega Venusaur. Make him change the right on to Melt Metal again. So we can leech seed that Melt Metal. Uh, there's Mokalola. Okay. It's okay actually. So Mokalola, what does he can do? So let's protect to see what does he want to do. Fire Punch, okay. So we shall change to Snowlax to our Zapdos. Let's change to Snorlax to see what uh, my opponent wants to do. Okay, there's Snorlax. He does the Fire Punch. He doesn't get the burn, it's okay. He may go to a starter Eevee. Let's go and down either the mug or the switch on Melt Metal. No, he talks. Okay. Now he's gonna change. He's gonna switch. So, I don't know. Let's go for Zapdos. Okay. So, let's go for Roost. He's probably gonna switch to Rhydon. Yeah, there's Rhydon. He takes a stealth rock damage. We recover our own HP, then we can go back to Mega Venusaur. Rock Slide is okay. Leech Seed again, that mug is asleep. Melt Metal. 
we will take the Lich Seed damage we can protect in the second turn if not either Mew, Gyarados or Starter Eevee she doesn't have something immune to Lich Seed so let's see what is he gonna do Rock slide, how much damage does it dealt? It made to my Venusaur. Okay, he changed, never mind. There's the Lich Seed. We can protect. Double Iron Bash. We recover. Uh, health, we can change to Zapdos. Now Metal is slowly losing health Oh, he, he rested as well Okay So this right on We can hard switch back to Venusaur Let's do that This right on Yeah, then Let's Mega Drain In case he stays no, he doesn't stay. So he's probably gonna go for that burn move. So let's go for a Snorlax. Okay, protect. So let's go for Facade. It's pretty slowly. It's okay, there goes Starter Eevee Yeah, there goes One Pokemon, one annoying Pokemon less There's Muck, I think we are faster No, we aren't There's Fire Punch Let's just attack with Facade Crunch Yes, Snorlax goes down What do I have for my for mock? I know that too, but it is dead. <laughs> okay, so let's go for right on Venusaur. We can leech seed. We can go for our own mock. Or no. The, uh, let's go for Zapdos. Let's go for Zapdos. He's gonna change. Uh, for right down, he's gonna switch. Let's just uh, substitute in case he wants to toxic. But no, he stayed. He he switch. He switch. Let's go for roost. Let's recover health for another switching into rocks. There goes rock slide. He's perfectly fine. So 72 speed, 69. Let's go for Venusaur. There go air there goes earthquake, let's go for Mega Train. Now he won't. There go let's go for Mega Train. Okay. Let's go for Saptos. Okay, 39% on that right on. Okay, let's boost the game as he changed to right on and takes uh, rocks damage on his state. It's okay, we have Thunder Wave, but I don't want to risk. Uh, 
Okay, so Venusaur is kinda low on health. So he may... Oof. If Mark wasn't sassy. Venusaur should be fine. Earthquake. So right down now we may lose. We may lose this one. Let's go for Lixit. Okay, he stayed. Let's go for Mew and start to make some things. Let's uh, go for a ball cup. He's gonna change, I think, to Mega Garados or no, Makalola. He may want to toxic us. Let's go for a ball cup, another ball cup. Okay, we are plus two. He uses toxic. He's fine. We have a facade. Now uh, what he's gonna do? Melt metal, okay. We can come later. Let's go for Zapdos. He's gonna rest, okay. So let's roost. Okay, he's prob probably gonna earthquake expect me to roost. No, no, I don't have reasons to roost. Let's go for Mac and do something. He's gonna rest as well. Okay, just let's gonna uh, crunch. Let's crunch. Let's crunch again. Okay, 25%. Let's crunch. He got the defense rub. It's okay. We have new. Let's go for that facade. And there goes Ryder. So there's the sleeping melt metal. Let's roost. He's asleep. I'm gonna switch to Zapdos. Now I'm gonna sub. Now let's attack Thunderbolt. There we go, melt metal, Dover Iron Bash. Now I'm gonna roost. He's gonna hard switch into Mew. Let's do Thunder Wave. We are not gonna be faster. Okay, he's set up Mew with Nasty Blood. He avoided the Thunder Wave. Okay. Psychic is not enough. Now he's paralyzed, so let's change to Mew and work on facade. Let's go into roost. Anyways, we are gonna lose. Let go facade, flame thrower. Okay, here's Zapdos. He's not gonna leave after flame thrower, but let's attack with Thunderbolt. Okay. Now 
the smell metal let's roost ok roost here we go double iron bash let's roost again how many? two two iron bash ok then there goes Garados let's uh, oh, thunderbolt or thunder wave let's go for damage Okay, almost. There goes Crunch. We don't have a defense drop. It doesn't has it doesn't have priority. So there goes Mega Garados. So we may be able to win. There goes Roost. Double Iron Bash. Uh, Roost again. So he doesn't have more double iron bash. Let's go for Thunderbolt. Okay, here for fit. So we managed to get a win in this in this match with uh, Sabtu surviving so many attacks at the end. So let's go for another battle. This video is going nearly 22 minutes, so this might be our last battle. So there's a lot of nine tails, cloister, Charizard. Let's go for Aerodactyl because half of its his team is with two rocks. Okay, there's Mew. Probably it's gonna set rocks. So let's go for stealth rocks. It's okay. Let's go for taunt in case he wants to set rocks this second turn. Yes. So rock slide mm, no he went for rock slide himself let's go for mock yeah so what does he have for uh, he has hit molly so let's go for for a crunch no for a fire blast let's see if we can okay he stayed Okay. Let's go for Crunch. He's gonna set rocks. And Mew is almost dead. So let's go for another Crunch. He's. Yeah, he doesn't get a flinch. There goes Mew. So half his team is gonna take uh, much damage from rocks. So let's go for a Fire Blast in case he wants to set up with Shell Smash. Yeah, there goes Shell Smash. Fire Blast connects and almost. Okay, not a problem. Let's face it as he attacks. Okay, I don't know if Cloister got priority if he gets Ice Shard in first gen. Anyway, he's. I think he's faster than all my team. So. Okay, let's go on a Snorlax. Let's go on Flamethrower. Yeah. Hydro Pump, not enough. Oof, luckily, not enough on my Snorlax. There goes, he comes, uh, hit Moonly. It's okay, he may be attacking with, uh, fighting type move. So we can go on Sabdos. I don't think hit Moonly gets a rock slide. Break break, perfectly fine. Let's go for Roost in case uh, he knows rock slide. Okay, he stays. Yeah, there goes Rock Light. I was right. So he does have he does have a Rock Light. So Snorlax, I I don't think Snorlax is useful anymore. Venison. Okay, 
Dark Aerodactyl is, is Aerodactyl is still useful. So let's suck off Snorlax. Rock slide and doesn't go down but uh, Brick Break will do the final Yeah, the final hit. So let's go on Venusaur. Let's Mega Ball and predict the change on Charizard so we can reach it that thing. She doesn't change. Okay. Let's see it lands. Let's go for Sludge Bomb. Let's go for another Lichid in case uh, he wants to hard switch into Charizard. No, he doesn't. It's okay. So let's just protect and gain some health back. And let's go for uh, a sludge bomb. Yeah, a sludge bomb. Okay, now let's protect and there goes Himuli from Lich Seed Damage. So there's only 3 months on my opponent's yeah, uh, side. So here, here is Charizard. Do we need Venusaur anymore? No, he's gonna roost. I don't wanna... I don't wanna let Charizard roost, so in case he roost, let's go for a Lixit. No, Flare Blitz, it's okay. It still does, da does damage on Charizard. So let's change to Aerodactyl, anyways we are faster, we have Earthquake to hit uh, Jolteon and Ninetales Alola. So let's go for Earthquake, there goes Charizard. Yeah, I stayed with Mega Venusaur because I don't, I didn't want Mega Charizard uh, to have the opportunity to rust and have the health back. So here is Jolteon. He may go for Thunderbolt. So let's change back, switch back to Zapdos. Thunderbolt. Oof. He has, no, he doesn't have an item. What I am saying, so speed is 181 as aerodactyls. So, okay, I'm gonna lose Saptos. Let's go to Mew and start to set up to set up on coal mines. Okay, shadow, ooh, shadow ball. Okay, we have a, sh a cold mine up. We can roost and tank another shadow ball from our jolt from jolt my opponent's jolting. Okay, we are gonna set up with cold mines. Thunder wave is perfectly fine. Anyways, you are faster. Another cold mine. Okay, we have the special defense drop. Doesn't matter. Let's go for boost. Another shadow ball. Another special defense uh, drop. Let's go for calm mine. Another calm mine. Another special and a para. Okay, let's boost this time. We have to rest again. Uh, Shadow Ball, oof. This battle is not is not in my favor, to be honest. Let's call mine. Cause sooner or, or later, later, I'm gonna be uh, paralyzed. So this is not in my favor. Okay, another call mine. Let's roost this time. 
a special defense drop. Shadow Ball, 25, oof. He, he's getting very lucky. Okay, another Call Mine this time. He gets 9 more Shadow Balls. Okay. Okay, not a special. Oh, I drop another drop. Let's go for a call mine. Oof, we get the uh, para this time. Let's go for a roost. Another para. So this is pretty over. We uh, should say. Yeah, this goes. <laughs> it is actually <laughs> goes down anyways from rocks. So yes, uh, this video uh, has been 31, almost 32 minutes. So I'm gonna wrap this up uh, to here. Only two battles, two long battles, because this Mega Venusaur team is pretty pretty bulky and works around some stall place so yeah I don't wanna make this video an hour long so if you like this video please click on the like button subscribe if you if you wanna see more competitive uh, let's go battles on showdown and if you want leave a comment down below and I will see you next time Goodbye.